Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. bottom of the deck we have the two of swords and this is air energy gemini libra aquarius energy so this is an energy of someone who is feeling indecisive they're overthinking a situation and they're very worried about the worst case scenario so they aren't taking action like this is someone who feels like they need to protect themselves they feel suspicious they have trust issues and they are really overthinking about what to do and it looks like they're choosing not to do anything right now and more so just thinking okay so let's see we have the page of pentacles earth energy the six of cups water energy and we have the page of swords air energy so this could be someone from your past with the six of cups being here they 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 miss you they want to reach out they want to come towards you but they're wary about it they're not sure if they should or if they shouldn't um we do see this energy of feeling like they don't know if you would really be open to them with the page of swords they they are trying to get information about you they feel like they they need more information um they feel like they they, they need to almost like watch you with the page of swords they could be looking at your social media asking friends about you this looks like someone who doesn't have direct access to you um so they, they're trying to find a way to figure out if it's safe for them to approach you okay so let's clarify these cards So we have the Page of Cups and this is Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio Energy. So yeah, they want to make you, uh, uh, like they want to initiate an offer. Like this person wants to start again with you. They want to renew the connection, but they don't know if you would be open to it. So we see a lot of page energy here. Like this person is uh, feeling like really small. They feel like, uh, you know, they, they, they don't even feel very deserving of this new beginning with you, but they want it. So they're, they're not very confident in themselves. Okay, so let's see. We have the Five of Cups in the reverse, Water Energy, the Ace of Cups, Water Energy, and the Strength card, Leo Energy. So they really want to make you an offer. Um, this person is hoping you still have love for them because they're still in love with you. And with the Ace of Cups, this is what they want to do. They want to offer you a new beginning in love. They want to put the past behind and start it over with you. But it looks like right now it's all in their mind. Like it's things that they want to do. They, it's like they're putting off actually taking action right now. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an Oracle card for you. So we have a win-win outcome is forecast, full moon in Libra. Yeah, this person really wants to, there's something here about the past. They want to put it behind. They want to start over. They want to let bygones be bygones and have a new beginning with you. But at the same time, they, they don't feel worthy. They don't feel good enough. They don't know if you would accept them. Let's see. Okay, we have, this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. So they feel like you, you're you the one for them. You were the one. And they don't want you to get away. Uh, but they, they it's like they're working up the confidence, the courage to, to try to come back around and make you a love offer. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we 
have dignity. A wise man has dignity without pride. A fool has pride without dignity. Okay, so they really are trying to make sure that they, they can remain confident because it does look like if you were to reject this person, it would crush them. This person, there's a lot riding on this for them. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Scorpio. Okay, we have surrender your desire to control people. Being over controlling can sabotage relationships. To more effectively achieve your goals, back off, regroup, and give the situation some breathing room. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Scorpio. I hope you have a really, really good day, Scorpio. Bye, Scorpio.